This is from a NASA press release. There is a link in the low bar. Our Milky Way galaxy contains a minimum of 100 billion planets, according to a detailed statistical study based on the detection of three planets located outside our solar system called exoplanets. The discovery to be reported in the January 12th, 2012 issue of Nature was made by an international team of astronomers, including co-author Stephen Kane of NASA's Exoplanet Science Institute at the California Institute of Technology in Pasadena, California. The survey results show that our galaxy contains, on average, a minimum of one planet for every star. This means that it's likely there is a minimum of 1,500 planets within just 50 light years of Earth. The study is based on observations taken over six years by the PLANET, that stands for Probing Lens Anomalies Network. It's a collaboration using a technique called microlensing to survey the galaxy for planets. In this technique, one star acts like a magnifying glass to brighten the light from a background star. If planets are orbiting the four star, the background star's light will, will further brighten, revealing the presence of a planet that is otherwise too faint to be seen. The study also concludes that there are far more Earth-sized planets than bloated Jupiter-sized worlds. A rough estimate from this survey would point to the existence of more than 10 billion terrestrial planets across our galaxy. Results from the three main techniques of planet detection, including microlensing, are rapidly converging to a common result. Not only are planets common in the galaxy, but there are more small planets than large ones, said Stephen Kane. This is an encouraging news, news for investigating into habitable planets. Um, there will be a link both to NASA's press release and to the full story on the Hubble site. Thank you for listening. Take care of yourselves. Goodbye.